Hello and welcome to this Microsoft Excel dashboard tutorial. In this video, we will be exploring the power of Excel dashboards and how you can use them to visualize and analyze your data. A dashboard is a visual representation of data that allows you to quickly see trends and patterns in your data, making it easier to understand and communicate. Whether you are a beginner or an advanced Excel user, this tutorial will provide you with the knowledge and skills to create your own interactive and informative dashboard in Excel. So sit back, grab a notebook and let's get started. So this is the Excel dashboard which we have prepared. It has multiple Excel charts and it is a graphical representation of the data of milk production. So we will be preparing this with the help of MS Excel. So we will press Ctrl N to get a new sheet. So this is a new Excel sheet one and our, this sheet will be opened in the background. We will go to page layout and we will select colors as it is milk production so we will select few colors like medium and then click on home select these cells and drag down on home and we will color it down with these colors let's take this as brown And as the image is very small, I will copy it down. And then paste. And I will increase the size of this image. So I am giving a notification over here that this image is from PNG tree. PNG tree as it is not free. So PNG tree.com insert box. Production. I will select it. I will increase the font. I will select the font type Bohos 93. This is the one which I will select. Color it with a brown color. I will go to shape format, shape fill, no fill, shape outline, no outline. And I will adjust it over here. Cow milk production. Now, on the sheet two, we will prepare raw data. And this is called as dashboard. So, let me name the tab. We will get the raw data this sheet which we have prepared so this is the data I will select and I will paste so let me give you a brief introduction about this data select all alt OCA so first of all it is commercial milk production state wise like UP Rajasthan MP Gujarat Andhra Pradesh and in million metric ton this is the count and we will prepare a donut chart for this. So I will select this one. Insert tab. 
this is the donor chart pi okay so we have the donor chart over here Control one, chart option, legends. But uh, in this case, I don't want the legends, so I will remove. I will select data labels. Uncheck on legends, so these legends will go out. We don't want the legends. These values outside the cell. Before that, I will select this. In the chart, I will write the chart title. This is a chart title. I will select them and drag them. and uh, it looks good so i will select this and i will go to home i will increase the size to 18 and the font which i will select is bohos 93 i will select them these number values go to home tab i will increase the size of them and i will select bohos 93 and color them to brown color and this as well Press Ctrl X to cut it and go to our dashboard and I will paste over here by I will select it go to format shape fill no fill shape outline no outline all right so now you can see that commercial milk production I will increase the size of this chart move to the center go to insert illustration shape fill I will select the checkbox go to the formula bar I will press is equals to raw data and I will select this cell and then press enter now you can see the total of the milk production in million metric ton the total is this and we want this in the middle of the cell so I will select it I will select it go to home increase the size center I will select 93 font reduce the size of this bit all right 
okay now i don't want the border so i will go to shape format shape fill no fill shape outline no outline all right and as you can see it is in black color so i will select the color as well to brown to our second chart click on this raw data tab we will use it later on but before that we will select we will prepare a pie chart for this composition of feed supply in india as you can see this row is a combination of cell a b c and d because i have merged it down so i will select this data first i will copy go to new tab and i will paste go to home tab unmerge it first merge and center unmerge cell As you can see, the cells are now merged. So our first cell contains all the data, and I will delete column. So we have the column data in column A and percentage in column B. Go to insert. Pie chart, and you can see here is the pie chart. So first of all, as these legends are coming over here, so I will click on this add button. I will uncheck these legend, so it will increase the size of this pie chart. Go to data labels. Click on data labels. I will right click. Outside end. I will select this outside end. The heading of this. Composition of feed supply in India. Bold. Control B. For bold, I will go to Home tab. Select the color to brown. Select the font to Bohus ninety three, and increase the size of this. Check these numbers as well. Go to Home tab. Select the brown color, increase the size, and select. Cut it from here. Go to the dashboard, and I will paste. So let me increase the size of this. All right, size is increased. Now what we have to do. We have to, as I have done, I have already done the formatting of this. But if you have not done the formatting, then you have to select this cell. Press Control C for copy. Go to Home. Go to Paste. Paste is special, and Paste Formats. So all the formatting of that cell of this cell will come to this cell. Now you can see that it is also showing 186.98 and 186.98. So we will remove this just by selecting and deleting. Manually select it and move them out. Bit low size, so I will increase the size of them to 12, and for them as well. I will select the size to twelve. Shape fill, no fill. Shape outline, no outline. The third chart, the line chart. Now we will prepare this chart. Estimated yield milk yield ga gaps for India dairy herd. I will select copy. Go to insert. Line chart. And I will select this chart. Now I will not press anywhere. I will simply select it. Press Control X. And go to our dashboard. I will. Paste in chart title. We will paste it. We will again select it. Go to home tab. 
we will select the brown color ninety three format we will click on add we will remove these grid lines data labels outside and we will select then we will select this chart go to format go to shape fill no fill shape outline no outline first of all we will increase the size of this and now you can see that here we have the data like east west north south so what we will do we will color the buffalo lines for all the reason to green so first of all we have to select when we will click on these row it will select all the rows we have to select again click on one bar so it will select only that we will select the buffalo go to format shape fill to say green we will again select it for west green for buffalo of east green then indigenous we will select blue for indigenous we will select blue you have to only press one time and this line will be selected for crossbreed like yellow so i will select this format aharoni so it is clearly visible for all the reasons so we have prepared this as well now we will prepare fluid milk marketing channel we'll go to dashboard select them and why i am selecting them because there is a gap of three column columns over here so ch our chart may create some problem so it will not be proper to select the we will copy this data go to sheet 3 and paste this data shift cell left so i have to shift the cell left all right we have this i will select Press Ctrl C, insert these insert hierarchy chart. So this is a chart. I will cut from here, go to dashboard, and I will paste it. I will increase the size of this. I will select the chart title and Control Z. I will again select it. Go to Home tab. I will select the font. And change the format increase the size of these labels mark them to brown color bold them and i will select britannia bold format now i will Go to format, shape fill, no fill, and shape outline, no outline. Oh, it is showing. I will again click on it. Shape fill, no fill. Shape outline, no outline. These labels are already in the columns and it is again showing over here. So, what we will do? We will select them. And then press delete so it will increase the size of our chart 
so it is saying the big portion is for consumed in household not traded this format small scale vendor corporate sector and private organization sector and if you want you can select some different color as well we can select the black color for more clear visibility the next chart is indian dairy consumption by product to raw data indian dairy consumption by product what we will do we will select this area copy it down go to sheet 3 i will paste it over here and as these two columns are additional i will press control minus shift cell left all right so these are shifted on the left hand side i will select it by control a copy it down go to insert click on this option click on insert funnel so this is the funnel chart to our dashboard in the end and then paste scroll it down the name of the chart title copy dashboard this is a chart title i will press bold go to home i will select brown color the same format then i will select them the number percentage number with black color as black is clearly visible control b and drag to the right hand side uh, then i will select this area go to home increase the width size color will be brown bold by clicking on single bar you can change the color of these bar so i will select this bar and change the color by giving them some light color i will select this bar light color all right so we have given the color i will select it go to format shape fill no fill shape outline no outline it is not working i will again select it from here from the end border format 
shape fill no fill shape outline no outline i will select them by a single click increase the size of these number so as to increase the visibility and I will color the border with say brown okay data labels chart title access we don't want now this access all right all right so we have done the formatting now we will go upstairs go to home sorry go to insert illustration icons i will select cow farm tree bottle and then click on insert you can see that these icons are visible over here i will shift them upstairs I will ungroup it first. All right, so we will select the cow first, copy and paste over here. Increase the size of it. Then copy, paste one cow over here. okay so two is sufficient i will select both of them and go to home and i will fill some light color brown color all right i will select it move over here increase the size of it Select it and right click on it, group and ungroup. Click on yes. This is sun, so I will give them a red color. Home will be some light brown color. this grass will be green color and this one dark green color
we will delete them. Control Z. As this is time consuming activity, so you can delete them. All right, so we have the sun, we will increase the size of it. We will copy this, paste over here, increase the size of it. We will select some light color. Format graphic. We will increase the transparency. to 50% copy paste we will put over here and then cut from here If you want it, then you can put some diagram over here with the light color, else you can leave it. Right click on it, group, ungroup, click on yes, all right, so it will be in this color only, you can increase the size of it, right click, Format shape, transparency to 50%. And then, as you can see, it is Indian dairy consumption byproduct, and we have flute, ghee, butter, curd, other ice cream product. So you can insert image of ice cream. It is available in icons. All right, so this is the ice cream. We will move it over here. We will increase the size of it. Right click group, ungroup, click on yes, we'll go to home, color, more color, and as the ice cream is of pink color, so we'll select this pink, light pink, and the bottom, this color. Right click, we 
group format shape and increase it to 50 percent control z right so it is looking good you can remove this image so this is how we prepare our dashboard which looks very attractive and uh, let me increase the size of it a little bit all right so this is the chart which we have prepared so it looks dashboard which we have prepared and it looks good so whenever we change any data in our data set say jnk25 dashboard it will automatically increase the count of jnk to five this is jnk you can do one more thing share this format We will press We will right click on these number go to format data labels We will click on legends key separator and we will select new line Now select these number, right click, format data label, a window like this will appear or you can simply right click format data labels. You have to select value from cell. You have to select, sorry, you have to select category names. You can see the category names will appear on them same here we will select right click format data labels category name legend key new lines close it and you can see 